and all my desires and the secret things I'll never tell. Lord, you know them well. I remember whenever I was younger, I was um I was raised with like I always went to Catholic church because that's how my grandpa was and stuff, always helping out there and stuff like that. And I never really thought about getting baptized then and I thought it meant, I didn't know what it meant at that time. And all I knew was that I got baptized when I was younger and so I thought I was okay. But the more as I grew and stuff, I grew with more with Christ and I realized that I needed to do it again because I didn't know what it exactly meant at that time. I've always been with Christ and been raised up in a Christian family and stuff, but of course I didn't know what it meant in baptism and stuff. And I thought that I have already given my life to Christ. And I, for a long time, I was just, I didn't realize it, but of course I was going on my own and, and I need to give my life to Christ again to show him that I do really love him. And I just want to dedicate everything overall. And I'm thankful for everything thing that people have done to make this night happen and stuff like my mom and my grandparents and my stepdad and everything but above all of course nothing would have happened if Christ wasn't behind us every step of the way and um, just from the beginning he's been with us whenever it was just me my mom and my brother and we had our little family and stuff and then Christ blessed me with the best stepdad ever. So now I have two dads. And now I just owe it all to him and to make this night all about him. And I don't know what I would do without these two guys in my life. And now we have a huge family with three brothers now. And it's not just us three anymore. And I would never change it for the world. And I just thank my grandparents for always being there for me and just being behind me every step of the way and me having everything I've ever needed because of Christ and because I have people in my life that love me and um, I have three of the best brothers in the world and we, they drive me insane sometimes but it wouldn't be the same without them and I wouldn't be the person I am today without my brothers and my brother Josh has been there with me through everything, everything, all of the times that we've gotten in trouble, we both get in trouble. We're, we, he brings the best out of me and he can bring the worst, but I love him and I love Cabo because I haven't, I try to be the best sister I can be to show them right and just I want them to grow up and know that Christ is really number one and I wanted to thank everybody that came here tonight because without all of y'all this wouldn't even be possible and I just wanted all of y'all to know that without Christ this wouldn't have happened and most of all I'm thankful for him. <laughs> When we choose to give our love away without a righteous cause, so I promise to be true to you, to live my life in pure.